Hi Juan, how important is self-care and to look after yourself during this time? Hi Belle, thank you for your question. Um, it was difficult times in lockdown. As you know, we are used to exercise and train every day, play some football games twice, three times per week. So it was a very challenging moment for all of us, but I tried to stay uh, active, physically active, training at home however I could and also mentally active, trying to learn new things, trying to motivate myself and waking up with a motive. So um, I think that's very positive to do and I hope you have done something similar. Hi Ron, how are you doing? How did you find it being away from friends and family during the coronavirus? Hi Byron, thanks for your question. Yeah, it has been also difficult to not see my family or friends for longer than I am uh, normally doing. Of course, I've been living in England for many years now and my family and most of my friends live in, in Spain. So uh, during lockdown, it was difficult to not see them, but thanks to technology nowadays, we were doing uh, video calls and chats every day and I'm sure you all did that, uh, but you have to stay strong and and whenever things go back to normality, hopefully really soon, we can enjoy the presence of each other and I can see my family and my friends back, which they are very important for me. Hi Juan, what's it like joining a new team for the first time and how is that similar, joining a new school? Hi Kai, um, well my dad used to be a professional football player, so we used to move around Spain. I've lived in different cities, which meant that I had to adapt to different schools. Um, and yes, it, it's not very easy in the beginning when you arrive to a new school or in my case after to a new club, but it helps a lot to have a mindset in which you want to adapt. Uh, you want to make new friends in your classroom, you want to speak with maybe the teachers so they can help you. Um, and it's always nice when also the people that is actually there help you to settle. Uh, that's what I try to do. Uh, in here when, with every new player that is arriving, I try to help them in, in any way I can. And I think that makes your first experience, whether it's a school or a club, uh, much better and much easier. And it gives you confidence if, confidence if you are new. new. So um, yeah, try to find that person in your classroom that seems to be open to talk to you and help you. And, and I'm sure you, do, you will do great. How important is it to talk to people about your problems? I think it helps a lot and it helped me over the years. Um, when you are in a tense situation or you have some nerves, anxiety or frustration, um, as soon as you start speaking with someone and telling them what you feel, um, you have first a different perspective, a different opinion, which might be uh, helping you to actually release that, that feeling and secondly you, you just feel better just sharing it uh, so it's something that it's sometimes seen as difficult to do but I think it shows strength actually to have the courage to share your problems with the people closest to you because they of course will help you.